So insurance companies love Overjet, uh, and and they love Overjet because it improves their um, uh, review process, right? All right, I'm going to ask you a hard question. Do insurance companies love Overjet or do they hate Overjet? So insurance companies love Overjet uh, and, and they love Overjet because it improves their um, uh, review process, right? So they're reviewing claims, they're reviewing it manually and re it reduces their costs basically. So they can re review it more automatically, but also consistently and faster. And that helps the providers as well because now they're not, uh, they're getting... Uh, you know, a consistent uh, review, so not not dependent on which reviewer is reviewing their claim, uh, as well as that they can get the the all the SLAs met. Because a lot of times, what happens is, you know, the SLA. So here, SLA would be like the time it takes for uh, the insurance company to pay the claim out, or even give a response, give an EOB out. Uh, it might be longer than uh, you know a few weeks sometimes. And what happens is the the provider might have to resubmit their information and and still wait for it but you know it's just in the queue it, it's getting there so being able to process claims much faster more accurately more consistently is great for on both sides uh, and uh, and it helps uh, them run their operations more efficiently as well so do, do you end up getting more treatment though so they're they're paying out more treatment right but they're is it is it because it's preventing treatment faster that they like it also? Or is it it's it being so here, more preventative, more preventative yeah. care than than the big bigger treatment? It's about doing the right treatments, right? Like you know, and 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 you know, in dentistry, if you don't do the right treatment at the right time, it's all, like dental disease doesn't go away. It just gets so worse get and more worse. expensive. So exactly. So uh, and and why, why wait if you can actually do the treatment? Of course, like there are times when. You want to wait uh, and, and really see how it pr progresses as well. So if it's a small incipient caries lesion, for example, but you know, uh, uh, once you know that it, it, it's disease and it's, it's going to spread, it, it's better to treat it.